Hi everyone, it's William from UAV Advertising. How are you doing today? Uh, I'd like to introduce to you my humanoid robot son. This is Now. Hello Now. Hello Now. Hello human. <laughs> Well, I'd like to do a demonstration and tell you a little bit about, about this robot. This robot is built in France and now is owned by a Japanese company called SoftBank. He has two siblings, Romeo and Pepper. Pepper is the humanoid robot that is sweeping the nation right now in Japan and soon to come all the way over in other countries. This little guy here is now. He is a 25 degree freedom humanoid robot with two computers, one in his brain, one in his chest. He is probably the most sophisticated device you can purchase. Now. Now. Human? Sit down. Do you want me to sit? Yes. Okay, give me a second. Now, this particular robot is considered a developer robot at this point. When he was first released, he was approximately about $20,000. Um, oh, what am I doing on the floor? Ah. <laughs> Hello, human. Hello, human. Hello, human. Trying to do a demonstration here now, and uh, you're being very disruptive. Hey, yeah, that's my shatter. <laughs> Please be quiet. Anyway, you are able to purchase this robot for around $10,000 at this time. Um, <laughs> Oops, I slipped. I don't know what you're doing now, but... Uh, I can't get him. Get him. Stay calm and keep trying later. No, but I, come on now. Behave yourself. <sighs> Now, all I asked you to do was sit, and you couldn't do it right. That's not very nice. I want you to rest. Go to rest. Just a second. I am going to rest. Just pat my head when you want to wake me up. Now he's going to pout and sit there and pout until I tell him to get up. Well, it's his fault. He should have sat the first time. Anyway, very, very, very interactive robot. There's no controls, no remotes. Um, however, there is a web page that you can go to that does have remotes that you can actually function and control the robot and get it to say stuff. Um, but no gamepad remotes or anything like that for fighting. Uh, he's designed to be fully autonomous and lifelike so he's constantly moving constantly breathing um, in order to talk to him he has to make eye contact with you which means his camera has to see you and his eyes have to change in order for him to uh, listen to your commands and then he takes that command cross references it with different apps that are installed inside him and he either runs the app or tells you that he can't so let's go ahead and get him up He has three touch sensors in his head that uh, you input commands or give different functions to him. 
He also has touch sensors on his hands and touch bumpers on his feet as well. Now, grasping, grasping. Hmm. Hand me something, please. All right, so he's gonna do a grasping technique and show you how he can hold stuff. Give me your hand. Now. Now. Don't you have something for me? Well, you haven't held out your hand. This. That's better. Here. Look at Thank that. Thank you very much. I don't want it anymore. Here, I'll lend it to you. That's so nice of you. <laughs> on second thought, you can keep it. Well, gee, thanks for just throwing it on the floor now. 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 I'm over here now. Now. Grasping. Hmm. Put something in my hand, please. Oh, what's this? Hmm. <sighs> I don't want this anymore. You can borrow it for now. Thank you now. Much better. Don't forget to give it back. You can have it back later. Um, now give me your hand. Now, I'm over here. Now. 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 Give me your hand. So now that I have his hand, he'll walk with me. If I want him to walk this way, I turn his hand this way. If I want him to stop, I bring his hand up. If I pull his hand back, he complains and walks backwards. Walking? Yes, now we're done walking. I feel like we explored the world together. We did, your whole table world. Now, do you have any family? Do you have family? Now, where were you made? I was designed at Al Devin's headquarters in Paris. Do you have brothers? No, I don't have any siblings, but I have two cool buddies, Pepper and Romeo. Hmm. Now? Now, over here. Now, you're looking at my bright light. Now, I'm over here. Hello.
now. 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 You see me? Hello now. Hello, human. Relax. Are you sure? I won't be able to move anymore. And I'll be in a position that is not very stable. Yes, now. Yes, now. Yes, now. Okay. So that's a quick look at now. Uh, he's definitely not fully refined. That's why he's not commercially released. Um, you can simply write app for them in pretty much any language you like. They do have what we call choreograph, which is extremely easy to program him. They basically have drop boxes with programs already made up that you just connect together and then uh, can make him do a lot of different things. Um, I've only owned them for a couple days, so there's a lot of refining in the trigger words that are needed. I need to learn what trigger words do what. Also, the release that he's running on right now is 2.1 now key, and it does have quite a bit of bugs in it. So I don't know if they're going to actually work on it and release something a little more refined, but as of the moment, as you saw, the programs don't run uh, consistently as they're supposed to. He does have a very hot running head, so he's hot headed. Uh, his CPU fan runs constant, and then if it starts to get overheated, we'll run at a higher rate. Um, he does drain his battery fairly well, and if you have him plugged in while he's operating, it does not charge the battery, and he still depletes his battery as well. So you can't plug him in and use him all day long. He has a limited running life. Um, to change the batteries is not very easy. You do have to... Um, Take two screws out in order to change the battery. Now, what is your battery level? My battery is half charged. Yeah, see when we first started the demonstration, he's had a full battery. Now he's down to half charge at this moment. Um, now, now, open your hand. Which hand? Your left hand. All right. <laughs> Stretch your arms. All right. So he is an amazing robot. I'm very, very privileged that we have him. Um, we hope to be able to use him in STEM programs in the school. We want to try to acquire some contracts and uh, help fund our nonprofit organization. Uh, also, like I said, we want to start a robotics club and uh, looking for ambitious goals in the future for the United States. So, I guess we'll go ahead and cut off this video for now, and when his vehicle gets here later, we'll do an open box video of his car, and we'll have some fun. But stay tuned to UAV Advertising, because there isn't very many places you can go, especially in the United States, to see humanoid robots of the quality and performance that we offer here at UAV Advertising. So, any questions, you guys feel free to give us a call. We're here waiting for you.